To make it really happy, you get some banana liqueur. Now, this is Miguel's own special recipe. You might not have banana liqueur at home. You could use another liqueur. But he likes to put banana liqueur in it, and I like to add a little bit more than he normally does. It's okay. Is that okay? Yeah. Right. Love then, brandy. a lovely Spanish brandy, 103. And we put a fair amount of that in. Is that okay? Yeah, yeah. Is that really happy? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Happy. Very happy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Very happy. Excellent. <laughs> then, some Andalusian wine. Happy wine. Time it's to okay, stir. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Right. No, no, it's okay. A little bit of lemon. Lemon. Then we have some fizzy lemon. Yeah. And a little bit okay. of orange. A little bit of orange. Yeah. And what we mustn't forget yeah. is some cinnamon. Yeah. Pop in some cinnamon. And the sugar. And the happy sugar. Yeah. Because this is a very happy place. Yeah. And to make ourselves even more happy, you know, as a rest from grinding up the gazpacho, we can cheer ourselves up with the classic drink of Andalusia, the classic drink of Spain, which is. Cheers. Cheers. Salud. 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 Clive, Clive, I have really one of your big, famous, fat close-ups on the soup. I can just go to the finer points of the whole soup. You remember, I basically liquidised tomatoes and red peppers, green peppers, and all that stuff, and got that lovely soup there.